Now he's on your radio. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I break your concentration? No, I totally expected it. I think he's so handsome. I think... Ain't nobody got time for that. Rock that, homie. The Tony Cam Radio Show starts now. Welcome to the show, everybody. It's Monday. I'm in studio with the Hot Squad. Hot What's squad. going on, guys? Yeah, what what's up? going on? Jamil, we got Justin mean? and B. Rich. The whole crew is here. Oh, with the yeah. deli, yo. We <laughs> about to get down. We got a hot, hot, hot show for everybody today. Hey, man, where's Tony? Who? And Tony. <laughs> <laughs> right. I'm like, Tony who? Tony who? <laughs> Tony who? Like, Tony, Tony, Tony the group? <laughs> Like the 90s. Exactly. I don't know. Who are you talking to? Who are you referring to, B? Yeah, I'll tell you the tall, skinny guy. Hangs around the studio sometimes. Tall, skinny Where's these guy. sunglasses? Yeah. Only Tony I know is the janitor, yo. Yeah. <laughs> I know. That was the only Tony I the know, man. Guard. <laughs> I don't know any Tony. No, I take that back. I know a janitor named Tony and Tony Cam. Tony Cam. You know what? Tony's on the road with Trinidad James. Oh! Okay. Gold road. all in my watch. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. He got a, he got a, he got a, a record deal. Him and Trinidad. Wow. Yeah. Tony Cam. You know what? I ain't seen that cat in a long time. Yeah, it's been hey, for day. everybody that's listening, I'm Anthony Andrews. I'm actually Tony Cam's son. I'm glad to be here with the hot squad. We're right now. We're having a great old time. You know, it's five o'clock right now. You're listening in on your radio, going from home, work, yeah. going home, or you're going somewhere you're yeah. not supposed to be at. You know what I'm saying? Go if home. You, if you, if you, you just got off work, exactly. you better be on your way home. If you're going somewhere, your mistress's house, turn around and go home. Straight up. Straight about up. About 50 people just got in trouble right now. <laughs> right. Where is he at? I'm about to call him right now. <laughs> so what else has been going on, guys? I'm trying to figure out how this search is going, Jimmy. Well, listen. Oh, tell me about the be rich <laughs> Yeah, Six baby it. mama, <laughs> <laughs> the B rich wife, Mrs. Richie. the B yes, fine Mrs. Yeah, you hear about yes. that? Yeah, Mrs. Richie. Yeah, yeah that's what wow. we're looking for. So we got an email. We got an email like really, really late last week yeah. from a young lady. Yes. Oh, yeah, so I can't give you any details, <laughs> yeah. but people are really responding. Hold on, what do you mean you can't get us, man? Yeah, no details. I can't give like, him any details. Yeah. I can't give him any details. They're picking her. Yeah, we're picking her. Yeah. Me and Tony are picking her. He well, doesn't have any cute. safe stuff. <laughs> well, Tony, he's all into the pictures and stuff. I'm more in the, you know, I'm trying to get someone with a good personality and all of that stuff. So that's what I'm working on. I'm going to tell you. I'm not me. really worried about the picture deal. <laughs> I am. I know you are. Tony is <laughs> too, too. But I'm not. Okay. So listen here. He has six kids and five baby mamas. Come on. Why are you saying that's, a, that's not a bad thing? Why we always got to look at stuff as the negative yeah. life? I'm just Let's saying, look at the positive life. You can, right? He loves kids. Yeah. 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 He He's a great kids. dad. Yeah. Great yeah. dad, right? He is. All right. And then he's also, when when his kids grow up, he's going to have a great support system. Yeah, definitely. Right. Definitely. That's right. But I'm just saying, there are a lot of women who would pass him up based on the fact that he has these children. Well, get, you know yeah. what, B, and if they so, pass you up, you don't need them anyway. <laughs> yes, I know, don't listen to him. To with. <laughs> That's exactly <laughs> right. You ain't, you ain't looking for a buddy. You looking for a partner. <laughs> yeah. So that's, yeah. So that's, so that's, I want to take him to the movies. Exactly. You know? exactly. So look, ladies, if there's any ladies out there, any single ladies that really, really want to have a good man in life regardless of the six kids or 16 <laughs> kids. It don't make he a difference. six or 16. Look, check this out. This is 2013. This man is looking for a good woman that's going to take yeah. him to the dollar movie exactly. right now. Exactly. You exactly. know what I'm saying? Yeah, so going to buy him something. Right, yeah. but inbox us if you're interested. Seriously, inbox us. And we will bring you on the show after they pick you. Yes. We're going to go on a date. And we're gonna come on the show and, and get married and, after the date. And we're gonna and we're gonna tell you <laughs> tell us how her be whole be rich experience. <laughs> this is exciting, man! Yeah, it's like exciting. the local bachelor, yeah, like, like man. Ray J, dude. Yeah. Wow! Uh, like uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> I don't think Ray J's yeah, the one. Don't be Ray J. Yeah, yeah man, we shouldn't uh, 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 do that. Ray J's a hater, man. I, I I was always a big fan of Ray J. I was like, Ray J was a cool dude. When he, you heard that song, he came out. I haven't heard it, but I know the deal. And I'm gonna tell you, he. He might be the wackest dude yeah. like ever. Yeah, like he's, for real. He's ever. Really? Sorry, yeah. 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 yeah, like ever. Yeah. Come on. Kanye I mean, West is smacking okay. with a stack of money. <laughs> like uh, no, Bugs Bunny's hit you with your glove. 
yeah. yeah. No doubt. No yeah. doubt. Yeah. So Jamil, what's up with you? You getting you know ready for the me. for the fashion yes. show? Lights, cameras, fashion. The lights, is like camera. two weeks away. I've noticed you've been getting really, really serious lately. You like you, she's, it's like it's making her mean. It's it like, is. Yeah. 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 At one point in time, I thought it was. I was like, well, nah, it's just that time of the month. But, uh, oh, but really? it's getting, getting really, really serious. Wow. Like it's all going down. Look, y'all. Let everybody listen. I seen Jamil the other day for a rehearsal in the fashion show, and normally she's like embracing me with love. What's up, Bree? I ain't seen him. Like Cruella de Vil, man. Exactly. When I post her, I said, "Hey, Jamil, what's going on? Do not talk to me right now. I'm trying to get these models together." I said, "Wow. Well, let me fall back then." That none of this is true. Everybody who knows me knows that I am super nice and always. I I was about to say, I don't know when when that happened because I was there. She was real nice to me. Thank you. Real nice to me. That's why she's got the "I am love" shirt on because she's trying to tell people that she is love. I am. I mean, you love. Fact, everybody. By who? Everybody. <laughs> Nobody's inbox me. <laughs> <laughs> everybody. You're such a hater. I'm not Every, a hater. You are. All right. There's one or two reasons why you're wearing an I am loved shirt. One, <laughs> your self esteem is really, really low. And we know that right? the case. So we you're know trying that's to display that message, right? We know right? that ain't the case. Or, or. I think that you are trying to broadcast to the world that you're being loved and you're trying to make everybody else around you jealous. I mean, it's just, you know, sometimes you have to state the facts. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> sometimes you just have to do that. Go on to put it out there, put it put on it the on table, a you know what I'm <laughs> put it on the t-shirt and keep really? on going. You know what I'm really? saying? Yeah, that's it. I can't front though. You are looking fly today though. Thank I like you. your Dorothy shoes. They're like not the, Dorothy like shoes. The silver, they have you know, spikes the, on them. Yeah. She wore them specifically just yeah. because she had to kick you. It's like the hood Wizard of Oz. Why the hood? Yeah, the whiz. When I found out you were going to be in the studio this week, I was like, I'm going to wear my spikes. Wow. Just in case. That's fine. It is it That's is. why I'm standing all the way over here. <laughs> so look, guys, look, we've got a great show for you today. We got the PIMP Minute with Mr. Chuck, Chuck, Chuck Rose. Chuck Rose. Anthony Andrews, all up in your business. I will definitely get all up in your business today. We've got the hottest music in the country along with the super mix from DJ Ed. And A2 drops by the show. So let's get it popping. The Tony Cam Show is on your radio. So now we have in the studio Mr. A2 Andre Austin. Yeah, what is going on? What's going uh, on, man? What you up to, man? Man, back in the building, um, working. Yeah, working. The hardest working man in show business. JBJ, JBJ, A2, AKA JBJ. Yeah, <laughs> that's it. Working, 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 but uh, working towards something, you know. That's the key, man. Yeah. Always working towards something, not just to be working. Exactly. Just to be right. Working. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. So, so what are you working on? Yeah. Oh, well, I mean, like literally working like nine to five, uh, <laughs> you know, make sure the, the, the family eat and yeah. roof over the head. But, uh, you know, that, and then other than that, you know, still doing the music, you know, ventures, the, the clothes, everything, just trying to just stay. What kind of music are you doing? Classical? Yeah. No, uh, well, <laughs> it depends on how you look Bro's at it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I still do what you know. Yeah. <laughs> still rhyming, you know, making beats, uh, collaborate with everybody. You That's know. what's up, man. Yeah. Hey, look, I'm going to be honest with you, man. Anybody that can freestyle or can rap, man, has got a real talent. I wish I had that talent to be able to come off the head with something. You got it, you got man, it. Man, but I, much love to people like yourself, man, that has that rare talent. Cool, man. Appreciate that you it. Do stuff like that, man. But. I also heard that you got a movie coming out. A movie? What's up? So we yeah. doing Will Smith things yeah. now? Well, they, you know, they, say, they say I look like this L. Washington. So yeah. I, 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 wow. I'm trying to get my Don Cheadle on. Local Don Cheadle? <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to get my Cheadle on. But nah, really, um, nah, it's a movie called Brothers Keeper. Uh, uh, the director is Knife for Kid. Uh, it's, a, it's a real good venture. It's a real good um, story, movie. Okay. It's, um, if I had to describe it myself, if you've seen... Like faith based movies. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Now, if you've seen like uh, Fireproof or something like that. Oh, courageous. Yeah. yeah, get, yeah. That. get that out of your mind. Okay. This is going to like, it's in your face, it's going <laughs> to shock you, but it's, it's, it's so real. Like the message, it's, it's not to say Fireproof isn't real, but it's like, like this is something that like you would probably see every day. Okay. Or, you know, 
So it, it's it's gonna scare you, but at the same time, it's gonna make you put, think. Put that reality <laughs> yeah, right, on you. Right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's, so is the movie done locally? It's like, done. It's, yeah, a lot of it's, it's done locally. A lot of local actors, a lot of actors from uh, Virginia that the, the director knows. Okay. Uh, so yeah, it, it's got that local feel to it. You know, it's been shot here and there around the city, so you will recognize scenes and people. So. So, are you producing the movie? No, or are no, you no. In the movie, I'm just in the movie. I'm okay, just, I'm okay. lucky okay. enough to be cast in this film. Okay. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm just nice. speaking on behalf of everybody who was in it. You know, nah, yes, yeah, I, well, I was lucky to be a part of this. Congratulations, yeah. Yeah, man. That's you. great, man. So, so it ain't gonna be like when the Master P bout it, bout it, no. Jones. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the worst movie ever made. I got the hook up. <laughs> hey, oh, he made money off of those. He so. did. Yeah, 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 that. Yeah, yeah, he did. No so. doubt. No, no. Like somebody taped that joint with their phone. <laughs> yeah. So, so what's the movie about? Give us a little. It's called Brothers Keeper, okay. and um, I play one of the brothers, but it's three brothers. One is without you know trying to give too much away. Absolutely. One brother is dealing with uh, the loss of his wife, and he's a uh, you know alcoholic. You know, it's, it's two years. The movie set two years after he uh, fatally killed her in a drunk drive. So he's dealing with that. Okay. You got another brother who is a pastor. He's you know ultra religious, and they're trying to work their dynamic out. And I am adopted into their family, and I grow up to become uh, kind of against the law. Type guy, you know, uh, without giving too much away. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> right, 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 right. Yeah. Without saying too, too much, but yeah, I'm, I'm kind of the anti everything. But like I said, a criminal. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That, that's that's what he's really yeah. trying to say. You know, yeah. I grew up as a criminal. Yeah, yeah. But, um, yeah, but it boils down to their relationship and their own individual struggles. And uh, it, each character is more than just the brothers. But each character has their own struggle that they're dealing with. Okay. And everybody's lives kind of inter, you know, intertwine. But ultimately, like the messages, like there's something for everybody right. in this. You know, you know somebody who's dealing with something in this movie. If you're not doing it, you know, going through it yourself. I feel the same way, man. It's like it's like being here in the studio. Yeah. All right, we brothers and sisters, right? Yeah. So I got my man B, my uh, brother yeah. for a minute, right? He's that low cat. That low key comp type of cat, yeah, ain't nothing real fashionable. Me, <laughs> ain't nothing you know, about he's real down to earth. Likes to have a good time, man. He's real fun spirit. Yeah, you got me. You know, fashionable, but you know, I like to also have fun. Hard worker. Yeah, I deal with stuff every day in life as well as B. And then we have Jamil. Yeah, and that's the troublemaker. That's the one that's the criminal. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So we were yeah. 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 dealing with that. The adopted she criminal. Adopted yeah. her. Right. She's the one out there doing stuff that she doesn't have no business so doing. she will relate to what I'm Absolutely. doing. Absolutely. Right, right. right. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. That's why they put you up here exactly. with me. I got you. <laughs> so have you done any acting before? Uh, Not on this level, I would say. Uh, You know, in high actually, that was my first love. I was coming out of high school. Like, yeah, I'm going here. I'm going to be an actor. I'm going oh, to- I didn't know that, man. Oh, I, love, I mean, that was my first love, just performing, being on stage, you know, doing little high school plays and stuff. But I really loved it. I really... You know, so once hip hop took over, and that's what I love was, once this opportunity, you know, came to me, I, why not? You know, how did the opportunity come to you? It, it's kind of odd. I think a, a friend of a friend of a friend knew the director, put it on Facebook, like, oh, open casting call, come through. Okay. So I was like, let me slide down there. And actually, the guy was like, you know, come through, you know. So I went down there and uh, read for this part. And, uh, I was like, well, you know, we'll call you back. You know, we got to discuss the, you know, right, particulars. Right. You got it. You know, come on. You know, so I felt like, wow, you know, whatever I've read, you know, impressed them enough to put me in this film and play this part, which is, um, that was a very important part of the film. So I really, like I say, I'm honored to even just be considered, you know, yeah. Thespian. Now, now for <laughs> those people out there, man, locally that want to get into the acting business, what would be some advice that you would give them? Oh wow! Uh, like Look I say, on Facebook and know a friend of a friend of a friend, 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 friend yeah, who knows yeah, the director. Yeah, well, that's true. That's true. Get on Facebook, guys. I'll tell you what, <laughs> the best advice I can give, being that I'm, you know, I don't have a sad car or anything like, like it's my first kind of deal. Best thing I can uh, tell people is, um, it's it's not what you expect, and I don't say that to scare people away, but it's not like you see on TV, like, oh, I'm just in front of the camera, and you know, I'm gonna be in Hollywood the next day. It's it's work. Like, we can shoot a yeah. scene that's two minutes long and be there till the sun goes down, making sure everything is right. So it's, you're working to try to get that, to tell this story. Like, a, a movie's an hour and some change. Okay. 
it didn't take an hour to change the film. Like it took some time. It took yeah. work. You're yeah, in absolutely. there. You're you become your project. So you have to willing. You have to be willing to invest that much of okay. yourself in the character, in the production, and whatever role you're playing. So, so you're trying to get that Screen Actor Guild Award, yeah. huh? <laughs> I, just, I just wanted, if you, you name a category, you can put my name in. That, you know, yeah, he's Sweet Floor. That, 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 you like, that's know. me. What type of movies would you like to do in the future? It, it anything. It, anything. Any, any role that I can speak to somebody. It could be a sports movie. It can be an action adventure. It could be a horror. Anything that Somebody can relate. One person can relate to what Well, I'm you're not going to survive in a horror movie, man. Well, <laughs> yeah, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You already know how you first five minutes, yeah. first, Now, you, you probably better off being notebook number two <laughs> yeah. than you are being a scary movie, hey, man. That ain't happening. For that two minutes, I may reach out to that one person. <laughs> okay, okay. You know, that's what it's all about. <laughs> yeah. So, is this movie available now, or are you all still working on it? That actually, you can pre order right now and. Knife is going to kill me because I can't remember the website off the top of my head. But you can go to Etsy.com yeah. and uh, search for Brothers Keeper. It's a pre- you can pre-order now. You can pre-order it through. Um, you can look on my Facebook page. I have the, the, the link. So forgive me, Knife a Kid, uh, for not remembering the website. But you can pre-order it now. And you can also uh, get it, you know, once it comes out, DVD, Blu-ray, you know. And it, the, there's going to be a premiere for it as well. So, okay. you know, once I get the correct information i can slide that to you all and we can put it out there but uh yeah it's uh it, it's definitely something that they're trying to get out to church groups and just people in general because like i say it's gonna touch a lot of people okay and i sent i sent some information to um mr cam you know wherever he may be and, uh, <laughs> you know, who, who are you never, referring I to now? I, I don't. I don't I know never Cam. met a Tony I Cam. Yeah. I, I don't know who I Mr. Don't, Cam yeah. is. I said, I said there's yeah. some animation. Yeah. There's, there's a lot of, uh, <laughs> you know, there's a lot of, uh, you know, proceeds going to, you know, a charity and everything. I mean, this this movie's more about, or the project, I should say, is more about reaching people than, you know, personal accolades. Like oh, we did a film. I'm in this. I'm, so we're really trying to push that. So once everything comes out, and you know, I can or you know, it can come out a lot better than I'm articulating Absolutely. it. Absolutely. You know, get the information out there because there's a lot of people I really believe will receive something from this film. Yeah. Now, can you nice. get Jamil in a film if she wanted to be in a film? Could you She's her? already on film. She just don't know. <laughs> oh. oh. Sorry, what? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> wow. I don't even know how to take <laughs> that. Either. I got a film. Hold on. Can you, can you get that red box? <laughs> Wow. Okay. <laughs> I'm very confused right now and I don't yeah. know what happened. Stalker's handbook. Yeah. The stalker's handbook. Hey, 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 <laughs> nah, nah, nah. I'm just kidding. But, uh, oh, man. That's what's up, man. Uh, yeah, I don't I don't have that kind of privilege. Like, yeah, she can get a movie, but uh yeah. Oh man, that's cool, man. I'm glad that you're doing film, man. You're doing what you love to do. Coming out the gate, I'm very proud of you, man. You're starring in movies. You're going to be taking over Hollywood soon. <laughs> They're going to make Lynchburg the next Atlanta or next Hollywood. It's going to be the third time when people are going to come Sounds good. And, and be here and, and support people like yourself, man. So, hey, real quick, also about the music thing, yeah, man. Yeah. You are a very prominent yeah. artist, man. Like, people know all about A2, right? Oh, yeah, you yeah. Know. I've been hearing great things, yeah, man. Cool, if if cool. the record exchange was still open, man, you'd be, you'd be oh, artist of the year. That was there, my man. Spot. Yeah, 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 man. Yeah. I love record exchange back in the day, man. Yeah. So, well, look, can you spit some for us? Oh, yeah. yeah. If uh, you're comfortable, man. If yeah, you're not I'm, comfortable, I might have take over and spit something myself. I'm please. comfortable. Please, please spit some for us, please. Uh, please. <laughs> Thank you. I'm trying to say, Jamil. I'm just saying. Don't just... don't be fooled by the suit and tie. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, I can do a little something. Let me see. You know, got to get my rhythm together. All right, um, let's see. All right. Am I locally known as the chosen one? Vocally blowing away my foes who come approaching, hoping they can see me boasting like they so hot when they rap and I froze them. Showed them they bogus flowing, composing like Bach. Call me Sebastian, I'm shocked. Because some of these rappers are phony, I'm not. Focus my thoughts flow when I jot, notice the plot. If you open my heart, you see that I'm nowhere like Pac, Jigga, Anaz, Biggie, your mob. I'm holding my spot. See, my mind's like a field gat, so feel that. Ill raps like pill caps, thrill caps, and buffalo bills hats. Bills that chill to the back, Tommy Hill black coats conceal that. My mind's like a twisted beer cap. But conscience under pressure never spill that. I burst like it's worth 10 mil flat. $100 bill stacks represent real raps and skills that I use to reveal that. The fact is, 
Luckily, I just feel humbly crushing them. Otherwise, in my clutch for juggling notions, they even touching me. Bogus, what they uttering mostly amounts to nothing. See, Muhammad Ali, my style, sting like a bumblebee. Going, on, cause, going bonkers, this king is what I ought to be soon. Because as I prosper, they probably see me conquering. Taking me out of my throne like they some harlequins. Amusing me hardly so to the lines, then I'm tossing them. My focus mind is steady. Supporters throwing mac and fed again. It makes me feel as if the throne is mine already. The crown I knew was mine with cool designs, but that's only shine. I sell the juice for studio time. Prove it ain't about the title. It's about the struggle. Mind you, that swag you put above you doesn't rule so one was lied to. People. Wow. That's, that's called an MC. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you lucky that I ain't got nothing off the top of my dome. We almost did a 103 9 cipher up in here, man. <laughs> yeah, Lee BT gonna be calling uh, us, man. Yeah. That is great, man. man appreciate it, boss. Much man. love, yeah. man. That was very impressive, man. Cool, man. I was up in this joint jam like I was in the club, <laughs> yeah. man. Even though it's Monday, I still I was jamming like <laughs> I was in the club, man. Word. Yeah, that's word. cool, man. Well look. Good luck to you in your movie. Appreciate it, bro. You know, keep us posted and when it comes out on DVD. Cool, cool. It's and soon, um, soon. next thing you know, we're going to be seeing you in Regal, man. There don't it is, doing man. your thing, be out there yeah. signing autographs and stuff, man. Don't forget us, dog. Yeah, oh, don't no, forget no, us, no. man. Don't move up in the world and be like, oh. man, I don't know I don't know oh, them cats, hey. man. Yeah. I don't know right, them he cats, about to start man. unfriending us. That's what I'm saying, man. <laughs> I'm, I'm nothing, nothing without the people who are listening, so I appreciate y'all putting local artists out there, everything, you know, having a, somewhere we can come and, you know, speak our minds, so. Uh, you know, we really appreciate You know, the people talk, you know what I'm saying? So on behalf of the city, you know, Absolutely. we appreciate what no you guys doubt. are doing. No doubt. So. You're welcome. The, well, it wouldn't be, if it wasn't for the people, we wouldn't be here as well. You know, yeah. we'd just be talking to ourselves. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So much love to the city of Lynchburg cool. as well. But A2, thanks for coming through. Appreciate it. And sharing your skills with us. Yes, sir. And yes, we'll sir. be looking for that DVD, man. So yes, much sir. love. Hey, Thank can you. I get the bootleg at the barbershop? All right, we're moving on. We're moving on. We're moving on. We're moving on. No piracy here. We're moving on. Good looking out, brother. Thanks, man. If you want to be a guest on the Tony Cam Show, send an email to radio at camentertainment.com.